Hello everyone, welcome to ThatGuyReviews.com. I am going to quickly show you how to install and set up this uh, Osaki Pro Paragon 4D massage chair. And for uh, more information about the reviews and what I think about it, check out my website at www.ThatGuyReviews.com or uh, check out my other videos. Now before we get started, there are a few important things to note. Number one, it's recommended to have two people to install this chair. It's very heavy. Number two, make sure there's enough room to recline, a minimum of 10 centimeters from the wall at the head and 50 centimeters where the feet is. And number three, make sure that you place the massage chair on a flat level ground and not near wet places or in direct sunlight just to avoid any deterioration to the upholstery. Now that's out the way, let's get started. Now that everything's out the box, it really is just four big pieces. You have the main chair, you have the footrest, and then you have the two side uh, arm pieces. All right, so you'll take the right arm piece and you have this connector. And you basically want to push that inside here. There we go. Now that's snug and fit tightly. There's these two ear tube tubes also that you want to plug into the uh, two white pieces here. This is going to uh, inflate your earbags for the air massages. The tubes are all connected. You simply slide the rest of the body in and you'll hear that click. And now there's this uh, plug here. You'll, you'll take that out. And what you'll want to do is tighten this up. There's a, there's a, uh, a screw, so if you look in there, it's a shiny screw in here. So once I tighten this up, this arm piece will be in place. Screws are in tighten. Just push this black back in. All right, now we'll work on the other side. Now that we've gotten the one side in, the second side would simply follow the same matter. Slide that in. First, let me just get the power cord in. You can see the identifiers one and two. The white one will go two, the black one to one. Make sure you don't bend the wires or the cable. This is where all the air is coming to. And I'm gonna let it slide down in position. You'll hear a snap, just so you know that it's in place. There you go. I'm gonna to move to the side, the air side airbag here, pull out the plug so that way I can screw in the uh, side arm piece. Make sure it's tight. Just like the one on the right, we'll do the same for the left. Okay. Now that the arm pieces are in, I'm going to now put together the footrest. Now looking at the bottom of this, this chair actually comes in zero gravity position, uh, which allows me to easily access uh, the bottom of the footrest area. So I'm going to unscrew this. I'm going to lift open the latch. I'll do the same for the other side. This will allow me to go ahead and pick up that footrest uh, position in such an angle that way it will sit right on top of the, the clamp um, and it will tighten it up and, and I'll show you what I mean. So now I'm getting ready to put the footrest together. I just noticed that there's holes here for screws. So 
So I would have to unscrew these and put that on. I'm going to go ahead and connect the power cord and also the ear tube. Push that in. Now we'll go ahead and put the um, covering over this now. Now that we have tightened up the uh, the holes and a power connector for the leg rest, uh, we're going to go ahead and now put the leg rest in place and then close the latch uh, and we should be on our way. So the leg rest has wheels underneath so it allows you to kind of position it the way you want it much easier than uh, the rest of the body. Uh, now what we'll do is, as you can see here, um, this is going to be positioned to sit here and that's what I'll be lifting this up to do. Like, just like that. What we'll do is close the clamp down. All right, now that we have the leg rest and both arm pieces in place, what we want to do now is power this uh, massage chair and it's going to sit itself back up into the um, normal position because right now it's in zero gravity. So um, you will come to the back side of the gravity chair or the massage chair and there's a power plug. Uh, and I'll plug that in and I'll plug this into the outlet and then I'll hit the, the power button here and it should turn on. You can see it's coming out of the zero gravity position as it was powered on. takes about a second. You can see the mechanics moving in right now. There you go. Full upright position. Here's the controller for the massage chair. Um, and if you look on the right, right side of the chair, towards the bottom, there's a plug, and that's what I'll do. I'll plug the control cord in. I'm gonna push this in, and make sure you guys uh, screw the cap tight, so that way you guys, when you're using it, you're not gonna pull it out of place. Okay, so it comes with four uh, fabric pieces, and uh, this is gonna be the main body, this is the seat, this is where the remote's gonna be hanging from the side of the chair, and this is actually your pillow, so it sits on top just like that. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys how this is going to be put together, uh, starting with the, the remote piece, right? I guess you call this a remote um, case. So, okay, so on, underneath, I guess above this airbag, side airbag, there's a Velcro. You can put your hand in there, you can feel it. You simply take the bottom of the, the other side of the Velcro, slide it under, and that should keep that in place nice and snug and the remote itself will just come right above that on top of that all right okay so we're gonna put the seating fabric in um, if you look right underneath here it's kind of tight but you'll see a zipper we'll just go ahead and zip this up all right, I'm tucking all this in a zip it. pretty easy to zip up Tuck this underneath. There goes one. And then there's a second zipper. That's where it's the bottom. Go ahead and zip this up as well. Alright, so the seat's done. I'm gonna go and work on the base body now. Put the first piece in. 
and uh, there's there's actually a uh, a clip here. We'll velcro that in together on both sides. There's a zipper up here as well. I'm gonna go ahead and zip this one up. Tuck this all in. The last piece is the, I guess you'll call it the pillow or the head case. Uh, you notice that there's a Velcro, so that goes right along here. Um, there's no zipper, and that should be the last piece before we can start using it. And there you have it. Osaki Paragon 4D massage chair. All right, so the installation or setup you call it would take about 20 to 30 minutes uh, at most. Um, it's pretty straightforward. You know, there's not a whole lot of pieces to put together. Um, very intuitive. So, you know, I uh, would recommend um, at least reading a book you know the first pass and uh, there you have it you know this is a, a nice looking chair we're we'll looking forward to reviewing it and uh, for more information just visit uh, thatguyreviews.com for the full review and uh, this is a, a setup video so um, looking forward to it and thanks for watching